Hi, welcome to Philip Carry On Style. Glad you're tuning in. Most of you out there don't mind spending the time it takes to do a thorough blowout if it'll last a few days and still look fresh and energetic. Watch as I take you through the simple steps to get a sexy, smooth blowout that lasts. Begin your blowout by focusing the air at the base of your hair by the scalp. Run your fingers through the area where the warm air is concentrated by the roots. Lift the hair with your fingers to create volume while removing excess moisture. So before I start blow drying her hair with a round brush and getting smoothness to it, I'm gonna apply my nozzle here so I get lots of control. Lightly stretch as you slide the round brush from roots to ends. Follow with the airflow focused on top. Hold for a second and release. You can see when you're blow drying, what you wanna do is have control of your section, slip the brush underneath, bring the blow dryer around from on top and shoot the air towards the ends as you follow through. What this does is it helps you to smooth down the cuticle of the hair and you get a nice shiny finish onto the hair. Once you get a solid grip on the section, rotating the brush a few times like I'm doing here will create a polished finish. Hold the section to cool for extra body and bend. Release at different angles to achieve scattered movement. Once your section is smooth, watch how the spiraling creates movement. So what you wanna do first is grab your section. Again, put your brush in from the underneath. Hit underneath first so that you lift the volume up and heat those roots to really lift out. And then what you're gonna do is follow through on top to smooth. For added lift, insert the round brush high under the section. Heat the base and over direct the brush back. Then cool for a few seconds. I like to turn the brush on its side, heat it, and cool for more movement. Again, spiral your release and you'll get smooth ends. She has like some short pieces. So what happens is if you go in and roll this all the way out to the ends, the short pieces get no bend at all. They're just, they just end up, you know, kind of not very finished. And so what I like to do is roll it up in the brush and heat it up like up in the upper base of the hair and roll it in and let it cool there for a while before moving out. Heating the hair at the base while lifting the brush high at the crown gives your hair the perfect crown bump. So you can see we just got a nice finish on the hair, a nice polish from um, the blow dryer and the round brush. So what I'm gonna do is take a little bit of star oil and that's gonna help me get a little bit of shine into the hair. And what I do is apply it to the ends first. So you want an oil that will give you some luster to the hair. And so I'm just kind of running it through the ends because I know they're gonna drink it up. This blowout will last you several days. You've done a great job. Look at all the texture. We got shine and volume as well. You're gonna love how all your efforts creates a sexy, smooth blowout that lasts.